Greetings from the International Space Station. I'm astronaut Sultan Niyadi and today's question is, have you ever wondered what an analog mission is and how it differs from the mission I'm part of? It is evident that weightlessness is a distinct aspect of the space flight. That is why while on the ISS, we actively participate in various scientific studies to understand how our bodies function in this unique environment. Before conducting studies on the ISS, scientists often perform similar research on Earth in controlled physical models called analog. These models replicate the effect of spaceflight. For example, head-down bed rest is one type of analog model used to replicate the physical and physiological changes experienced by astronauts in space. The science objectives of the cardio breath study that I participated in were validated using this analog module prior to its implementation on the ISS. So what exactly are analog missions? They are simulated space exploration missions conducted on Earth that replicate the common conditions and challenges of actual space missions. Analog astronauts live and work in closed habitat, just like an actual astronaut experiencing isolation, confinement, limited resources, and communication delays. Analog missions provide opportunities to understand the different aspects of spaceflight, developing countermeasures, and train astronauts with new technologies and skills for future missions. The first UA analog mission has successfully completed as part of the Scientific International Research in Unique Terrestrial Station or Series 2021 mission. Analog astronaut Saleh Al Amri participated in an eight month isolation study at Sirius facility in Russia's Institute for Biomedical Problems or IMBP, concluding 70 experiments. These included five experiments from four universities in the UAE, covering the fields of psychology, physiology, and biology. One of the scientific studies that has been conducted by researchers from Mohammed Barashid University of Medicine and Health Sciences, or MBRU, in collaboration with partners from Austria and Canada, focused on understanding the impact of isolation on cardiopostural interaction. Thank you for joining me today.